When you're setting up your Zenfolio site, I highly recommend that you create a portfolio. This is used to show off your best work in order to attract new clients. Your portfolio can be a single gallery containing a mix of genres or a group containing several different portfolio galleries. In this video, we are going to create a single portfolio gallery. Let's start off by creating the gallery. When you title this gallery, keep in mind that it can affect your SEO. So dropping a few keywords in the title, such as the location you work and the type of photography you do, is not a bad idea. You can also add a caption, additional keywords, and categorize it, all of which will improve the discoverability of your portfolio. Since this is a portfolio gallery, go to Gallery Access and make sure that this gallery is public. Also, make sure that downloading is turned off, and then on the Search and Metadata tab, make sure it's set to be publicly searchable and click Save. Now let's add some photos. If you want to upload portfolio images from your computer, I would suggest getting them organized into a single folder on your computer first and then uploading them into the gallery. You can also add photos from galleries that you have already uploaded to Zenfolio by clicking on the gallery in your organizer, selecting a photo, or you can multi-select by holding Command or Control on your keyboard, then go to Photo Actions, choose Copy, select your portfolio gallery, and hit copy. I would recommend having around 30 of your best photos in your portfolio. Next, I suggest taking some time to properly title, keyword, caption, and categorize each photo. This will help with your SEO. I'm going to do this by holding command on my keyboard and selecting five similar photos, then click photo details. Now I can add a caption, keywords, and categorize all five of these photos at once. Make sure to click save once you're done, and then I'm going to give each photo a unique title. Then I'll just repeat this process until all of the photos have been updated. Traditionally, portfolio galleries are not selling galleries, so I'm going to make sure that there is not a price list assigned to this gallery. However, if you are a fine art or landscape photographer, you may want to keep a price list on the gallery. Now that we have our portfolio gallery created, in the next video, I will show you how to customize the appearance of the gallery. This is Robert with Zenfolio Customer Support. Thank you for watching and good luck with your account.